This morning on Forever Young, a guide to life after 50, dating again. Older people back on the dating scene usually find themselves facing some unique problems, but dating as an adult also has distinct advantages that the young just don't share. Tom Blake writes a newspaper column on dating and relationships. He's also written a book called Middle Aged and Dating Again. Tom, good morning. Good morning, Jack. You probably never thought that at your age you would become a dating expert. How'd that all come about? Uh, three divorces and lots of dates. <laughs> I guess that leads you to become an expert, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah. Uh, actually, four years ago, I came home on Christmas Eve to an empty, cleaned-out house, and I started to write some notes because that would, you know, it surprised me a little bit. And then I started to date, and it was pretty crazy out there. You get stood up at blind dates, and I kept notes, and finally uh, had about 75 pages and said, you know, this stuff looks pretty good. So I just sent it off to the New York Times and be on the, the bestseller list, but it doesn't quite happen that way. <laughs> well, A lot of rejection, but I started writing for the local column and, and the paper that was four years ago and 250 columns and two syndicated columns. And you are now the expert. Why do you think it is particularly difficult for people over 50 who get involved in dating again? Well, there's two reasons. The first thing, we're not prepared. You know, you're prepared for retirement, you're thinking you're going to go to Florida and play golf, and all of a sudden you wake up single and you go, wow, this is overwhelming. What do I do? Where do I start? Where do I begin? The second thing is, once you're out there dating, you got to find somebody suitable, and that's not easy either. You know, you're pretty set in your ways, and uh, you're sitting there on your first date, and you say something, and she gets up and leaves at the table, you know? <laughs> said, I guess that wasn't the right line I was looking for. Right, was right, it? exactly. Y your columns that you write and the book that you write are obvious, obviously written from a male perspective. Mm -hmm. What sort of reaction do you get from women who are reading them? Well, women love the, the male perspective because most of the books written about dating are written by women. So when one comes out uh, in the male perspective, they really gobble it up. Now, they may not agree with what they read, but at least they'll understand the male perspective, and it helps them communicate a little bit, a little bit more, that type of thing. One of, the, one of your sort of rock-bottom recommendations here is that older people should look to date other people their age. And you had your own sort of epiphany here, your own experience that led you to that conclusion. Yeah. Older guys that date younger women, that's a hot button with women, first of all, but older guys that date younger women may be...